Hey guys, so this is Flickr. It has great potential in the classroom and it can also help you a lot to find, you know, high quality images for your own classes. So let's have an overview of what you can do here. First, uh, you need to sign up. You can sign up with your um, Yahoo account, Facebook or Google account. In this case, I have already logged in and you can see here on the right side of the screen you know my uh, my own profile photo there and then you can see my own uh, wall with images from people I follow it's very social it it was one of the first social media sites in fact very collaborative and with wonderful images so um, when you sign in first you need to come here and go to your settings there so that you can edit everything like you know it's very important that you have your profile photo so that you you are seen as a person somebody will trust and you know will follow and you know be in touch with you have the privacy and permissions you have email no and notifications sharing and extending and here is the place where you can connect like for example with your blogger account your Twitter so that if you upload a photo here you can blog your photo straight from Flickr so it's it's a very interesting way of doing things yeah so here you go for example I can even upload photos through email yeah I can blog I can upload a photo and then blog it through email as well so um, it's just a matter of clicking around and playing around with it so this is my profile page and that's where you should go first and set your own profile so this is the the bar here the breadcrumb bar so then here that's where you are gonna click for um, you know for Flickr features and uh, this week we are going to connect in Flickr through photos yeah so these are my photos mm, I'm hungry now <laughs> So we are going to connect, uh, I want you to click here on communities and you are going to go to group. You are going to look for the web tools for educators group, okay, so you can look for it here searching or you will get the, the link to the web tools for educators page on our uh, virtual classroom, in our virtual classroom in Moodle. Then you are going to come to this page. You need to join the group, okay? And once you, you've joined the group, you can just be here and you can add photos. And then we are going to have some discussion activities here as well as, you know, photo uploading and photo playing. So we are going to play around with Flickr. Another very important thing here, and you'll see it's going to be really helpful is when we talk about Creative Commons, uh, a way of sharing images and having no copyright issues. And um, in order to get to the Creative Commons photos, like photos that are licensed and you can use for your classroom, you just go flickr.com slash creative commons. Once you get there, just click and you'll see the different kinds of licenses we have here and you can play around as well. Um, I also love, for example, when I find interesting photos, I just uh, uh, come to the photos and, and I just favorite them. So here you have all my sets of favorites and if you, here, let me click there. So then every time I find something interesting, I can just save it for, you know, future use or something like that. So this is just one nice feature that I can keep all my, you know, interesting images for the classroom um, also here you can uh, in the explore page there are tons of interesting things that you can do and explore um, for your classrooms and with your classroom so I would highly recommend here uh, the explore part of it you can get like galleries you, you have a world map with images um, you have the commons uh, photos from uh, different you know library archives that you are also free to use 